Hi, in this video we're going to work on the raw data page. Specifically, we have one visualization to add to this page. It's a table. As you can see here, by the um, business requirements document, this is a potential solution for this table. Okay, and then obviously on the next page we have our design notes. Okay, this one's a pretty quick and easy visualization to add to any application. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on our Power BI cloud service, Power BI service app. I'm in my account. I'm going to click on my project. And as you can see, it opened up to the last page we were working on, the rankings page. I'm going to switch over to raw data. And of course, the page is blank because we haven't added a visualization yet. Okay, so let's do that. I'll click edit. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to look at our visualization icons here. I'm going to select table right here, table. Click on the table. Let's make it the length of the page. Give it some room here. Okay, great. So how do we create our table? So pretty easy. I'm, again, I'm going to switch back and forth between the application of Bower and the business requirements document here. You can see here it wants me to do the show title, category, week hours, weekly hours viewed, and rank. Okay. So we'll do here, we'll click on our data. I'm going to build visual. We'll do again the show title, the category. I'll just keep clicking the boxes here category, the week, the hours viewed, and then the rank. So that adds all our data in here. Okay. So now we can go through and go ahead and format this table, make it a little bit more professional looking. Okay. So I'll go ahead and click on format your visual. So let's do values. Okay. So we'll have the values, um, change our fonts. Nope. To present. And as you can see, we'll do this. Maybe what a 14 we'll try. Make it a little larger. I would do a 12, okay? And then we'll keep the text color black. Um, we could do alternative background color white, and then we could do, we do, I'm sorry, the background color white, and we do an alternative background color. We will do a light blue. So you can see it kind of helps for visual, visualizing each row. It, it alters the colors, okay? So we have that set. All right, couple, just a couple quick changes that totals. We really don't need the totals for this. You can have the totals for your table. We don't really need them. They're not important, so we'll turn those off, okay? So we'll turn the totals off, all right? And um, let's see here. We'll do general, and we'll have the title of our, of our app. We'll show that, and we'll call it raw data. <laughs> raw data. And again, we'll change the font. size, color, i ah, make it bold. There we go. Okay. So now we got one more thing we can do here. Okay. Now we'll go over to our visual column header. So let's do column header. So let's change that. Okay. So I'm going to click on font. Again, same. Font, font family. We'll do the font color white. Uh oh, but we'll go background color. We'll go the blue. So again, it gives us a nice header area there. Okay, we can make it bold if we want. And I'll make sure the header alignment is to the left, the center, or the right. I'll, I'll keep it to the left. Makes it a little bit more professional looking. Okay. So, so we got one more thing we're gonna do. And what I like to do is. You notice how the header gives us show underscore title as an example. Okay, let's change that. Okay, let's make again look a little bit more professional looking. So we're going to go ahead back to build and notice here. Here's the columns we're showing. I'm going to click the arrow and it says rename for this visual. I'm going to go ahead and rename. I'm going to call it show title, removing that underscore between them. All right, great category. I will click here, re rename for this visual, we'll call it show genre. Okay. Uh, we'll keep year, month, quarter, we'll keep all that stuff the same. We'll do here, we'll click on rename for this visual. We'll say total weekly hours viewed. 
and then we'll say click here we'll say rename for decision we'll do weekly ranking okay and there you have it so now you have a the table of the raw data again when we show how the application is um, used you'll see where this will come in handy okay so again that's it. That's all our visualizations we have for the application. That concludes this video. Thank you for watching.